happy Sunday. I'm not going to vlog too much today, but I wanted to include this in the week in my life. So I'm about to go to a basketball game. Pretty simple makeup going on. And then my little MSU scrunchie that I've shown before. And then I'm going to wear my Eddie Bauer um, jacket instead of my long North Face parka just because it's easier to like fold under your seat when you're standing in the student section. But we are going to get there around like 11.30 and doors open at 12 and the game starts at 1.30 so we'll be probably standing outside for a little bit so we can get decent seats. But yeah, I'm cooking breakfast right now. So I just have this chicken sausage from Trader Joe's. It's already pre-cooked. I'm just trying to pretty much get it a little bit crispier without burning it because last time I totally burned it. And then I made some toast and I have like 10-ish minutes till they get here. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of proud of my breakfast. It's not the healthiest, but it's very, actually, no, it's healthy. Got some healthy fats, some protein, some carbs. Then the only thing that's unhealthy is my juice. Oops. My mom sent me with some orange juice, so I'm gonna drink it so it doesn't go bad. And then my lovely plate here. All right, I got like 10 minutes to eat this, and then I will see you guys at the basketball game, Michigan State versus Michigan. Good morning you guys it is a Monday morning the first day of classes for everyone else but I don't have Monday classes so I'm actually not gonna vlog today I also obviously didn't show that much yesterday because this video is mostly supposed to be about the first week of school and of classes um, I'm not vlogging today because I'm doing a productivity video getting all my calendars and my schedule for the year kind of outside of classes all lined up and put together and showing you guys kind of my thought process for that 
workouts, extracurriculars, friends, all that kind of stuff. So if you want to see that, that video is going to be up before this one. So I'll put it in the description below and also in a card up here. So yeah, I will see you guys Tuesday. Good morning, guys. Happy first day of classes. Last first day of undergrad. It's crazy. I'm going to quickly show you guys my outfit, then I need to put on a little swipe of makeup and get to class. I already packed my lunch and stuff. Um, I'll try to show you guys stuff throughout the day, but it might be a little spotty since it's my first time in all the classes. I'm not trying to be like, hey, you know, I might just do clips on my phone. I don't really know yet, but I do gotta get going, so I'm just gonna show you my outfit and then I'm going to start walking to class. That's my outfit, you guys have seen all of this before. Um, just the sweater from Marshalls and the black ripped jeans from Old Navy. Um, brown watch band, pretty simple jewelry, scrunchie. Little necklace, it just has a lightning bolt. It is bright and early, 7.30 a.m., we love that. Quite excited, I'm ready for these classes. I had homework already due the first day, so. It's going to be interesting. A lot of dressing. Do you want to say hi? from class we only had to go for like five minutes for physics lab which I knew would happen so I have some time to edit and stuff um, I'll give you guys like a recap of all the classes later tonight after my meeting for pre on a club eboard <laughs> So it's late on Tuesday, I just finished my yoga per workout routine that I just started yesterday. In Thursday's video you're going to see a grocery haul and my workout, fitness, diet routine. I'm trying to eat pretty healthy, cook a lot at home, I have a set workout routine that I'm doing. So I just did yoga in my apartment which is my Tuesday workout type thing. Um, it was really really great. I did. Um, yoga with Adrian on YouTube and just put it on the TV in our living room and put my little mat out there. It was good. Um, let's reflect on the day, shall we? Actually, I want to sit. I want to be comfy with you guys. Okay, so reflecting on the day. First day of classes of my last semester of senior year of undergrad, all that. It was really good. I had the three classes I showed you guys a little clip from each but I have friends in all of them which is great lots of AED friends in the micro recitation and then my roommates are all in genetics with me as well as a bunch of other people that I know and then um, the third class was physics lab no like genuine friends but like girls that I've had classes with before and that class I just sat with them that's a perk of I guess like getting higher up in your major you start to just know people in your classes even if you're not like outside of class friends with them so the day was good, it was busy, um, physics lab got out really early, all, the, all my other classes took the whole time just going through like syllabi and then they all started like reviewing material and stuff like that. Micro, like I mentioned, had homework due so we went through like a worksheet for that. Yeah, so school was good. And keeping the vlog this week pretty surface level, I'm not getting too into detail like day to day what I do just because I know I'm going to be doing other vlogs throughout the semester and I'll do days in my life for those to go into more detail of like what 
hour by hour, for example, I'm doing. Um, I definitely skipped a lot today. Like I had an e-board meeting. I didn't really show you guys like all the planning and stuff for that. I didn't, I just kind of glazed over dinner. I didn't tell you like how I was making it or anything. Um, yeah, so that'll be more in like a day in my life video where we're gonna watch some Bachelor tonight. It was on last night, but we wanted to watch it as roommates tonight. So we're gonna do that while I do my genetics homework that's due for recitation tomorrow morning. And that's my only class tomorrow. And then the rest of the day, I just have some work for my online classes to get done. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow morning. And I'm very excited and just feeling very grateful. Wait, speaking of grateful, actually, I wanna show you guys this a book I got off of Amazon it's not really a book but um let me prop you up here okay you're on the most unsturdy tripod so it's on like a fake vase but I got this one line a day book one of the youtubers that I've been really liking who I've literally just started watching literally like two weeks ago I'll put her channel name I think it's Melissa Lucy or something along those lines she's pre-PA and I really relate to her for that because they're both like pre-health vlogger gals um she got this book and i literally ordered it that same day except she had a different like style it's the same book inside it's just a different color i liked it to be more neutral because my room is very like neutral colors and i wanted to be able to put it on like a shelf in my room without it standing out i guess so it's one line a day and so you open it up for example, I don't really care if you guys can see what I wrote. So it has the dates yesterday, January 6th. Then you, it has 20 and then you write 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024. So five years you'll end up putting in here. And I think it's so cute because this is going to be like senior year and then all of dental school. And then by the end, like over the summer, I will have been graduated from dental school. So it's going to be so cool to look, at, look back on when I'm like older, just like how my days were as a dental student, finishing up undergrad, stuff like that. Um, yeah, I kind of write a little blurb of just like the things that happened that day. As of now, I'm gonna try to keep it kind of as like gratitude or like things that made me happy that day. But if I have an awful day, like I'm gonna write it cause I think that's like life and it's good to be honest and transparent with yourself and that leaves room for like growth and everything. Yeah, so that is something that I started last night that I'm going to be doing every night. Um, if you guys want to see a night routine, please give this video a thumbs up and I can do a night routine. I can also do a morning routine. Once I get in a better morning routine, my night routine is pretty good now since I've been back from um, like winter break and stuff. So I feel like comfortable sharing that for sure. Um, another fun thing that happened today is that I signed up for an IM sports team with some people from AED. It's co-ed. So three guys, three girls. And I think that starts in like March perhaps I don't really know it's for volleyball I don't think I mentioned that but it's co-ed volleyball I played in high school from fourth grade through high school like travel national level and like for my high school and stuff so I used to be pretty good but I don't think I'm that good anymore we'll see I haven't played in forever but okay this clip I was like I'm gonna keep these videos short it's literally six minutes so I will see you guys Wednesday morning hey guys happy Wednesday I have one class today it's 10 p.m. 10 a.m. Whoa, it's 10 a.m. right now and it's a 10 20 class, but it's really close. So I'm gonna leave in like five minutes. I just need to quickly grab something for breakfast and put on non pajamas. Um, I'm gonna wear my workout clothes to class because I was supposed to wake up early and work out, but I didn't because I know I wanted to get some extra sleep. Um, I'm going out tonight, so I'm gonna be up a little later and I have plenty of time to work out since I don't have too much stuff going on for my classes. So I have mentoring after genetics, and then after mentoring I'll go to the gym, then I'll come back here and get stuff done until we go out tonight. So I'm gonna rush, so I'm gonna get ready and grab something to eat. Very cozy today because it's super snowy. Um, just wearing these Gymshark leggings I've shown you guys before, and then I'm wearing my workout tank top for later. like so so sore from my workout one day but I have to go do an arms and abs circuit after mentoring um, it's 12 right now I'm leaving at 12 25 for that we have quite the to-do list for the week um, I'm gonna try to do some of this YouTube stuff today if I have time but yeah lots to get done today and I have like 10 minutes till I have to leave I did not give myself enough time to make dinner but or lunch I guess I'm just eating leftover cauliflower crust pizza and I'm gonna watch a video 
but I only have 10 minutes. Then I gotta get to mentoring. On a schedule, that is always good. So I'm bringing my whole backpack. I have the painting stuff because we're doing a project with the girl I mentor. I have to bring my bags back out to my car. I have a new car hand sanitizer to put in there. Since I didn't eat much, I'm bringing this protein bar in case I need it before or after the gym because I'm going to do a bunch of errands after mentoring, which I'm excited about. I love driving. Got my water bottle, my keys, and then I have to take the trash out, which is glamorous. Done at the gym, it's 3.30. Um, mentoring was like 12.45 to 1.50-ish cause I had to like clean up cause we were painting and stuff. Um, it was really fun though. I'm like really happy about it because it's finally like starting to come together where she's actually like enjoying it and I'm enjoying it and I feel like she's actually learning something. <laughs> Whereas it makes me nervous if it's like a project that's purely fun because it's supposed to be challenging. And I would just hate for like the kid that I'm working with to go home and the parent be like, oh, what'd you do today? Oh, I watched YouTube videos instead of going to math. Like, I would feel really guilty. So I'm glad like she could talk about it and it could be something actually like educationally enriching, I guess. Um, after that, I had to drive Leone to the car dealership because her car was being serviced and that kind of pushed my schedule back a little bit. So I did my workout. Um, I did an arms and abs circuit. It wasn't that like high intensity. So then I did like 10 minutes on the elliptical after just to get a little more cardio in. My watch says 104 calories during yoga and 105 on the elliptical. So put in perspective, I did yoga for like 23 minutes and only burned 100 calories. And then I went on the elliptical for 10 minutes and also burned 100 calories. So it just like is all about the heart rate and intensity and stuff. But I still feel like that was a good workout. I'm so sore from Monday still from the leg circuit because that is high intensity, but also like really good strength training. I'm doing the Kayla Esteen's like bikini body guide thing. I got the PDF like years ago and I still have it saved on my laptop so it's probably like different now if you bought it or did the sweat app or something but I just use that because it's free. <laughs> um, yeah so I'm gonna go home. I'll probably show you my dinner if I remember if it's anything fun and then um, tonight we're gonna go out so I'll show you guys my outfit tonight. Sorry for the lighting, I'm in like the parking garage, but Outdoor Voices has, I don't even know what you'd call it, sucked me in because they sent me this email. I don't even like hats. They sent me this email today saying that you get a free doing things hat. Isn't that cute? If you buy a crop or bra and I wanted to buy a couple more of their bras anyways so that's why I justified doing it now but I ended up buying two because there was one on like super clearance that's final sale I'll show you guys the ones I got so this is everything I ordered I got the doing things hat one of the zip bras that was final sale and then one of the doing things bras in pink because the hats usually 20 and then the bras are usually like 65 and 75 and then there was a discount on the one bra and then I had my 20% off student discount so that brought it all down to 86 which isn't that bad considering the total merchandise cost would have been a lot higher I do have a like referral code that like anyone gets like you get 20% off and then I'd get money if you use the codes. I'll put it down below if you're interested in checking out Out Outdoor Voices. Then there you go. A good opportunity because you have a discount. So I'm going to go back upstairs now that I spent all this money and get a snack because I'm so hungry. It's four. I'm probably going to eat some fruit and maybe some carrots. And then I'm going to make dinner around five or six, I think. Because we're going out, I think, around, well, we're going to like the pregame at nine. So I'll probably get ready at eight. That's my whole game plan. <laughs> Continuing on the topic of me buying things, um, over the weekend I ordered new black boots to wear like day to day because I've been wearing those Steve Madden ones that I hauled like way back in fall and they're already getting kind of beat up because I legitimately wear them every single day. So I wanted another another like casual pair that alternate between and I wanted them to be waterproof and stuff. So I actually ordered some from Converse and they look really cute. I have to try them on still. This is what they look like. They aren't like crazy platform, but a little bit. They're kind of like a Converse Tims or something. Um, I really like them. They look comfy. They've, they're supposed to have really good reviews because they're the Gore-Tex like line of Converse. I guess they're more like padded inside. So they're supposed to be really comfy. 
this part's like very like warm and soft so I'm hoping they're gonna be good I think they're cute I'm gonna try them on now and if I can get good lighting I'll show you guys how they look not really sure how I feel about them you guys will have to let me know what you think <laughs> guys sorry if you hear our dishwasher going but gotta have clean dishes so it is thursday at like 1 p.m right now i had one class this morning at 10 20 just 50 minutes um genetics she was just going over really basic like review prerequisite stuff to be honest i don't remember all of it so this weekend i kind of want to look over my notes from bio from sophomore year because i have really good notes just to kind of refresh on everything and make sure i'm not going to be confused when she gets into the new stuff and yeah, I have quite a bit of work I want to do over the weekend, but I honestly think I'm just going to save it for the weekend. Probably not good to start off. I'm not like procrastinating because it's not like due for like a long time, like almost a full week. So I'm just going to let myself kind of have a chill day. I don't think I remember to show you guys like what we did last night or like what I wore or anything. We went out, we went to two different bars. Um, I just took one picture, I'll put it in here for you guys. Um, and for breakfast I just had some cereal and then for lunch I made a little pizza at home with some um, pita and like sauce and vegetables and stuff on it. It was really good. And now I'm just about to do some like YouTube planning for the school year to figure out what videos I want to do aside from vlogs. I have a few ideas. Um, my roommate got me this notebook for my birthday. So I'm going to write some of the um, like talking points for one of the videos out. That way I kind of know like what advice I want to be giving for this topic. And yeah, not going to vlog too much today because I don't think I'm doing much. But um, I'll talk to you guys later before I go to the basketball game tonight. I'm so excited. Uh, we're lower bowl again and it's going to be my roommate's both of their first times being in the lower bowl so it'll be really fun to like experience that with them so it's me lauren leone and then my friend alicia is also coming but she goes to lots of basketball games but i'm very excited and i need to go to the gym still today and other than that it's just going to be gym and youtube stuff so productive day and fun day for me when it's hobbies and not school stuff that i'm doing so i'm in a very good mood so I forgot to show my dinner that I was eating, but I just made some pasta. It was a really good. Um, here's, there's a lot of leftovers. I'm getting a lot better at like listening to my body and like how much I actually need to eat. So um, it's spinach, mushrooms, uh, some red sauce, and then just penne pasta. I had some strawberries. These are the ones that are left. I'm obsessed with these bags. They're by the brand Stra Stasher. They're like reusable. Um, like Ziploc ceiling bags. I have three of them. This is the sandwich size. They make a bunch of different sizes. There's lots of brands. Reusable bags, but I think these are the best ones. They're the most like high end, I guess. My sister gifted them to me for Christmas and I'm a really big fan. I've already been using them this week and like washing them in the dishwasher and stuff and they're perfectly fine and I've put like pizza in them and other strawberries. Like they're great. So I'm really happy about that and that's just like one more good thing I can be doing. So it's 5.48 right now. We're gonna go to the basketball game, like I said, around 7, 7.15. So I'm just gonna get some stuff done till then, and I plan on just like body showering after the gym. My hair is fine. I already worked out, so I just need to body shower and then put on some leggings and my is own shirt. So I'm excited. It's gonna be a really good time since it's their first game. You guys i'm actually gonna end off the video here just because i decided i'm gonna do a weekend in my life as well because i know it's getting really long so i will see you guys in the weekend of my life yeah.